why did I even buy this in the first place? This is ugly as shit. And like, I would never wear half of this stuff. This stuff is not cute. Like, ew. Like, so ugly. What was I thinking? You know what? I'm gonna have to like get a whole new wardrobe after this. What's up you guys, it's Hannah. Welcome back to my channel. So just a couple days ago from the day that I'm filming this was the first day of spring. And I personally love spring. I'm pretty much just gonna be doing some spring cleaning. And by spring cleaning, I mean I'm just gonna be cleaning out my closet because I do this every spring. I just feel like it makes me feel so organized and like fresh, kind of giving my wardrobe and my closet a fresh start. That's what I'm gonna be doing today. I'm gonna be cleaning out my closet, which is right here okay so i feel like we should just get started i'm actually gonna start with these two bags that are sitting on my floor they're clothes that i brought home for winter break from school so i'm gonna start by putting those away i don't even know if i have enough hangers i guess we can just worry about that as we go my hair's so tangled today and i just don't understand why <laughs> I've had this for so long and I don't even want it anymore. I don't know. I could still use it. Maybe. I'm just gonna put it back. Oh, I hate this sweater. I already know I'm taking that out. I don't like that either. Pretty much what I want to do is put everything away that is here and then once that's all actually put away, I'm gonna go through my closet and take out things that I don't want and make two piles. One pile of things that I think I could sell like on Poshmark or something and then another pile of stuff I'm just gonna donate to Goodwill. And I already am starting this pile because I bought this from the thrift store and it's so itchy that I literally hate it. So, so I guess Goodwill will be over there. Selling will be over there. Let's do this. Usually when I do this, I have something on the TV, but I don't know if I want to do that. Like just because I'm making a video right now. Okay, so the way my closet is even set up, so you guys understand what, what I'm doing here. I have obviously everything hung and I try and do it in color order, but it just never works that way. Shoes are on the top and shoes are also on the other side. I have two doors. So the rest of my room is just a big mess. Please, sorry. The rest of my room is just a big mess. Please just ignore the rest of it. There may be some changes coming to that soon too. So then down here I have, you can't even see it, but I have this drawer set which I put sweaters in. Like I'm already, I don't know where my hangers are gonna come from. I actually might just go through and like get rid of stuff while I'm putting stuff away. Cause I don't want this, but I think my mom might. I'm just gonna put it in the donation pile. She's gonna go through each of the piles anyway. So whatever. There may be a whole closet reorganizing video coming soon to summer ish because this thing hasn't been deep cleaned and reorganized and i want to say 10 years <laughs> i feel like i'm gonna get rid of half of the stuff in here because it's not my style anymore so that's good like honestly i'm like looking through all this stuff and i'm like why did i even buy this in the first place does anybody else get like that comment below like what was i thinking i might thrift flip this because this is ugly as shit, but i think that it has potential i don't wear any of this shit. This is insane. My style has honestly changed so much just over the past this school year. And like, I would never wear half of this stuff. Like what? Why did I buy any of this? Like this is never anything I'd wear. This is ugly. Like so ugly. What was I thinking? Like, oh my God. Like, bruh. I bought that. I'm sorry. I'm not trying to offend anybody if anyone thinks this stuff is cute. I was also throwing around the idea of starting a Depop. I don't really know what the difference is between a Depop and like Poshmark. I don't really know the difference, but I know Depop is popular. So I feel like I should try that. Why did I buy this? Please. A lot of these are t-shirts, which is understandable. Now this is what the we're talking about this jacket is it i got this from buffalo exchange and it is free people and i got it for 40 bucks i'm obsessed with this jacket what the f ew all right this i made and it's hideous i'm i i mean yeah this does not have potential i feel like this doesn't even have potential maybe see i go through this issue every single time where i'm like i don't even know if i like this but what if i like it in the future and then if i get rid of it what you know? You know what? I'm gonna keep it just f for fun. Don't like this and it does not fit. Wow, I'm making so much room already. I forgot about this. I forgot I was supposed to be putting this away. This is a sweatshirt that goes in the sweatshirt section. There's really no order to that section. Also, this dress is too small. Why do I still have this? Pretty sure like most of this 
is too small. I got this from Anthropology, and it shrunk in the wash because I'm literally so stupid. I'm gonna put that in the cell pile, I think. Or do I want to keep it? Like, I genuinely think that it's too small now because I shrunk it. Yeah, I'm just gonna put it over there because it's just, it doesn't fit. Like, that's so sad to say, but it really doesn't fit. Dude, I used to live in this in high school. I'm not kidding. This dress, I used to live in in high school, and now I'm like... Dude, I'm getting distracted. I'm literally getting so distracted. Oh, but I don't like this either. I feel like my mom's gonna end up like keeping half of this stuff because that's usually what she does. This stuff is not cute. Like, ew, it's not cute. Like, why did I buy that? This is from J. Crew. I used to have a really big obsession with dressing preppy and stuff. So I used to be a for J. Crew. Their style was like the style I wanted. <laughs> This shirt is a sad story because, first of all, like, it had potential, but I got this from Shein, I think, and it just didn't look like this on the website, and it is completely see-through. The material sucks, and I'm sad about this because this has so much potential. <laughs> but it failed like really bad. Also, I hate this. I don't know why I bought this. It doesn't fit right. You know what? I'm gonna have to like get a whole new wardrobe after this. And mind you, I still have a whole closet at school. Like this is just my home closet. The funny thing about cleaning out my closet is that it makes me realize that I have so many clothes for the fall and winter months and I end up in the fall and winter months literally just wearing sweatpants and a sweatshirt every day. So I don't even know why I have all of these clothes and I barely have any clothes for warmer weather. Like. There's literally one boot. I'm confused. Where's the other one? So I feel like we've gotten through a majority of my stuff. Like, at least everything in the closet. I feel a lot better. Like, I got a lot out. This is the sale, maybe, pile. This is the donate giveaway, unless my mom wants any of this pile. Literally, I feel like this could be an entire closet in itself. Okay, so now that I got rid of a lot of stuff in my closet that I didn't want, I am going to do a little haul of some new pieces that I was sent from Lulu's. This video is not sponsored, but they did send me this stuff and I love it literally so much. I can't... So I'm going to show you these things that I got from Lulu's. <laughs> I think that a lot of them are very springy. They're all springy except this. This what I'm wearing right now and what I've been wearing this entire video is from Lulu's. It's this black sweatshirt. It has this cool like, obviously I wanna wear this with not a sports bra, but you know, it's so cute. I'm gonna have all of the links for everything that I'm showing you guys down below if you guys wanna check anything out. I got this sweatshirt for reference in a size medium because I like everything oversized. I think that this sweatshirt was meant to be oversized anyways, but I just got it in a medium to be safe and I really like how this fits and I think it fits perfectly and it hits like at a really nice place. A few of the things that I got are accessories so I'll show you guys those first. I picked up this pair of sunglasses which are dope. They are pink if you can tell. I'm trying to like so cool. I love sunglasses and they hide my face. So if I'm looking a little crusty, I can just throw on a pair of sunglasses and I just feel better about myself. These are going to be difficult to get on, to get in, but they are these hoop earrings. They have a flower design on them. So pretty. So bold. I love these. I'm going to try and put these on in the viewfinder. Yeah, I can't. I'll be back. Obsessed. Hi. Oh my God. Love. And they're like perfect for spring because they have these little flowers on them. Oh, I'm obsessed. Okay. So I got this crossbody blush pink little purse which i love i've just started getting into wearing purses which is like really weird because i feel like i'm really late to the game on that but when i'm like public vlogging if i don't have a purse to put my vlog camera in i just feel really uncomfortable it just looks like this this is adorable and it has this cute little tassel on the side i'm really excited to use this so we have this shirt excuse how pale i am this is gonna look so good with the tan i can't even it looks cute with the earrings go off queen this is the shirt this i don't even know how to describe this material i feel like there's definitely a word for it but i just don't know it i think it comes down to such a good length this is also a medium it's see-through i don't know if you can tell as much on camera as you can in person but i'm just wearing a bralette from american eagle under this so then the last two things are shoes and you know what i'm sorry in advance for how white my feet are i just got out of winter i'm a naturally pale person 
person. I am the worst shoe model that has ever existed. They are just these platform espadrille sandals. I think that's what they're called. They are so cute. I've been wanting a pair like this for a really long time. They're very spring. I definitely get spring vibes from these. So that is the first pair of shoes. This is the second pair of shoes that I got. They are these Steve Madden. They're kind of platform, a little, but they're still like pretty low to the ground and walkable. And these are gonna be, I don't even know what I'm doing right now. Like these are gonna be such a staple. They're also so comfy. I don't know what it is, but I feel like I could just walk in these forever. So that is the end of today's video. I feel like it's so fun after you're, you're done doing your spring closet cleaning to go and treat yourself and buy some new pieces. And I'm definitely gonna be hitting the thrift stores really soon to add some new pieces to my closet as well. But I am so happy that Lulu sent me those products. Thank you guys so much. I really, really like them a lot. So with that, that being said, that is the end of today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching this. If you guys like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. I wanted to make this video more of like a casual, just chill, like me talking to you guys while doing something video. If you guys wanna see more of stuff like that, let me know in the comments below. If you guys wanna see more videos from me, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And I hope you guys all have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.